Hello everybody, how are you doing today? And welcome back to the garden. It's a lovely sunny day for a change. As you can see, we haven't seen the sunshine for weeks. So I thought it's a good time to do some quick garden tour when we have a bit of a sunshine to look at things. So let's start. might not be much happening the winter is quickly approaching as you can see the water lily barrel it's slowly going to sleep it's still trying to grow some fresh leaves but I don't think they're gonna do much most of the plants are going dormant the blueberries lost almost all the leaves The dahlias are still trying their best. It's a nice splash of their color in late autumn. I am still getting some ro rogue flowers every here and there. The calendula, as always, it never gives up. There's few marigolds here and there. See all the leaves are falling of the trees. All of the fruit trees gonna get a winter prune soon. Same with the fruit bushes. The chickens are enjoying the sunshine as well. Let's start from the veggie area here. And as you can probably see, I lost all the light. Just realized I lost half of the footage I was recording earlier on, so I thought I'm gonna try to record it again. But it's much later in the day. So here we are at the first veggie bed where I planted my broad beans. Looks like almost all of them are germinating. Close to 100% germination. Same in the next bed. That's the bed I covered with the compost recently. We are getting close to 100% germination as well. That bed is now ready to go for the winter. Same with this one here. I'm covering it with the grass clippings and uh, excess pond plants. I've cleaned the pond the other day. So this is all the excess plants. Also my rhubarb patch, it's all covered with the grass clippings. So that's ready to go for winter as well. If you watch one of the previous videos, I did the pruning of the pear tree and the grapes. So this is all done. That's the next bed I'm gonna be working on. That needs clearing and covering with compost. 
same with this strawberry patch needs proper weeding that's always the most weedy area of my garden for whatever reason it's another bed done covered with compost in the spring and now just with the cardboard I need to get more cardboard probably to cover the rest of it but that's all ready to go for winter as well and let's have a quick look in a greenhouse so we have 100% germination of the elephant garlic and I planted in between some lettuces that I saved from the outside they wouldn't do any anything outside anymore it's too cold got some flat leaf parsley with plenty of seedlings after the old parsley plant dropped the seeds we have the broad beans they are looking much better than the one grown outside it's slightly warmer here in the greenhouse and we have our cuttings that's lavender and thyme all looking good so far that side of the greenhouse is normal garlic and some strawberries that's looking all right as well close to 100% germination on the garlic I think there's two cloves missing but I can replant it shortly the greenhouse is all cleaned the grapes are still waiting for the winter prune but there's still plenty of leaves on them so I'm gonna leave them for another two three weeks probably yeah as you can see the winter is with us already everything is falling asleep so there's not much to do just the winter jobs protecting the beds covering them I have just noticed a cool thing in the greenhouse there's a rogue strawberry strawberry flower that would be quite cool to get some fruit in the winter I'm not counting on it much there's only one flower I can't see anymore but that would be nice a strawberry in the winter so I think that's all for this quick update it's amazing how much better the garden look in the sunshine we really needed some sunshine there was no light at all for weeks and weeks so I should enjoy it now. I might have a glass of wine and enjoy the sunshine. I hope you guys are well and I'll see you next time. Bye.